Jordan about to act up in the new G80. Why not? <laughs> Why not? What's up guys, Jordan here from RK Tubes. As you see, I'm driving right now, I'm in my 570S. I'm heading to BMW. So, the G80 is out. I didn't go and start off and say, oh man, G80's coming, I gotta pre-order it, everything else. I wanted to do it, um, there was no all-wheel drive that you're allowed to order yet. Because there's nothing that I can just go order right now, I was like really, really, I am not really about it. I want an all-wheel drive auto, white F, I'm sorry, G80. I just know the all-wheel drive is gonna be the best. The F90 all-wheel drive is amazing, so why not get the G80 in all-wheel drive? You click the button, it goes rear-wheel drive, so. I was gonna wait. And then like, I got super hyped up, my friend got super hyped up, and then all of a sudden I was like, you know what, screw it. I'm gonna go get a G80 right now if there's any allowed. The problem is, a lot of people pre-ordered and they, they waited, and a lot of the pre-orders aren't even at the dealer yet. Most of the ones at the dealer are just cars that BMW North America just chose and sent to random dealers. So by me, there's a bunch of Brooklyn gray ones. There's some greens. There's a few whites. Like I found one frozen white, but it's real. Also, everything right now is rear wheel drive. So like, I'm not even that hyped up about getting one. Cause I was like, ah, I really want all wheel drive. I don't want to buy it twice. So I'm just like, what do I do? So I decided I'm gonna go get a rear-wheel drive G80. If I'm gonna get a rear-wheel drive one, then I really, really want the all-wheel drive one in the future, I'm gonna get a six-shift one. Cause it's, even if I get a, a rear-wheel drive one right now, it's auto and I make it really fast. In six months, eight months, whenever the new one comes out, everyone's getting dusted, everybody. So I'm going right now to test drive one. I'm pretty hyped. So I don't know how good or bad it's gonna be. I think it looks pretty horrendous. I haven't seen one in person though. I've only seen online. But we're gonna see how it is, and we're gonna see what they let me do on this test drive. All right, so I'm here with Minty from G2. And they got me in this F80. Obviously I said before, just do a test drive, but I mean, we can sort of do whatever you want because it's test my car. Already. So we're gonna go for a ride and do some burnouts. <laughs> Am I in that mode? That was really verbal, probably because, it probably doesn't verbal because I don't have a competition package. What do you think? I probably, I mean, the manuals only come like this. This is what I wanted, so whatever, but it's really, no verbal, pretty sad. Let me press this exhaust button, what does that do? Uh, oh, that sounds way different. I have no idea what any of these buttons do other than, <laughs> this button is the most important one. The traction off button. Hopefully we can find a little spot. We're gonna find a spot, there's a G80 flex. Yeah. <laughs> First G80 on the streets. Yeah, I don't think, like, everyone, I see multiple people posting that they have them. And like, oh, I got my GD. Then you ask them for a video or a picture of on the road. No one has it. They have a picture of the background's dim. It's never like, we're out driving this car right now with free rain. So. Mm -hmm. uh, Traction hole's not off. That would help. You might have to hold it. Yeah. Problem is, I did that before, and then I pressed the M2 button, which put me back in, uh, put me back in, uh, Oh, Pretty good. <laughs> it's not bad. It's it's funny. I, I thought it was gonna feel so different, but I guess it's like it's rear wheel drive. It sort of feels like an F80. It's like an F80, but more technology. And then I'm gonna jerk the wheel and make the camera look all crazy. Yeah, just nicer technology. So. And the grill's really not that bad. No, nah, the grill's not. See, here's the thing. Like I said, I said a few minutes ago, the thing's fugly. But I mean, I, and this color is pretty good. In the black, you don't even see the grill. In the black, you really, really don't even see the grill. But in this color, it's not bad. It's pretty nice. As I smash the key. <laughs> good. It's also brand new. Okay. Sounds, sounds good. Really uh, quiet. Find another spot. He's going to record from outside. All right. Sounds great. That's fine. <clears throat> it's just super quiet, right? Mm -hmm. Yo, it's so quiet. Yeah. The comp's got to be louder. It's got to be. 
something. Or at least more verbal or something. Yeah, you need dog pipes. Yeah. That exhaust intake sign, bro. This thing was silent. You can right here. Yeah, I'm about to. Nice. Jordan about to act up in the new G80. Why not? <laughs> I like it. I'm 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 so much more excited now than I was before. Really but I literally was like, ah, whatever. I'm just gonna get it, get the all-wheel drive. But I mean, six year rear wheel drive. I, had to tell you you know, I know you don't care about this car, but it's really nice. He's like, now it's really nice. Now it's really nice. Before <laughs> I was like, because he was like, oh yeah, I got this one, I got that one, I got this, I got that. I was like, look, bro, gray or white, stick shift rear wheel drive. This after I went back and forth like without even talking to you, like two days in my head. I'm like, oh, yeah. When I called you, you're like. I was yeah, like, why not? <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh, why not? Let's just uh, hop in this. So. I just tried doing a donut, and it won't let me. It it literally, it might just sound like I'm lifting and chickening out. I guarantee I'm not. <laughs> also, where do you want to go, straight or right? Um, go straight. The guy probably right. <laughs> the car might look like I'm chickening out and lifting. I guarantee. Is there a car right here? I guarantee I'm not chickening out and lifting. The car is either like, do you just almost feel like the, the rear wheels, it's unlocking. So it probably has electric diff just like the F80. The F80, if you're on throttle, it stays on. Um, if you're on throttle and brake, it stays on. This one. Even though I'm not even touching the brake that much, I'm barely touching it, it's almost like it's opening the diff and completely killing my power. So, donuts are not that possible right now. I don't know, maybe I just need to be more of a man and <laughs> send a little bit harder and not try touching the brake at all and just whip it. But I'd rather not do that on a car that has like five miles on it, two miles on it, three miles on it, whatever it has that we just put on it on it. So, instead, we'll go back to rolling burnouts again. It's cool. I gotta learn how to do all like donuts in this thing. Now, when it's actually if like, I can't do donuts, I gotta figure that out. <laughs> That's a problem. Go straight. So quiet. Yeah, definitely needs exhaust like, and down yeah, pipes. It's crazy, it doesn't really spin that much, right? Yeah. Like second year floor, it just hops. It doesn't really feel that fast either, to be honest. F80s would just keep spinning. Oh, what? stock tire on an F80? Maybe we'll bang it right, right here and see. Yeah, maybe. Stock tires on an F80, useless, right? Yeah, like how many burnouts, yo, second gear. You look like a pro. Third gear, oh yeah, crazy. This one is like, I don't know, I wonder how much heavier this car is than F80. Yeah, we should have like people over here, but like, it's okay. <laughs> like mad people right here. Someone's car. Butts are growing Karen's day. I know. <laughs> now that lady, she looked like a Karen too. <laughs> it is good. It is probably fine. No, this is fine, yeah. Fine. After this, we can get out. He's already stopped. All right, so we're going to go out and record from the outside. Just try the burnout thing again. There's like not enough smoke. So we'll do one better one with some smoke. When you put Jordan in the G80, what do you think is gonna happen? Burnout. You know what time it is, G80 time. <laughs> All right, so that's it for driving my G80. I'm back in this thing. Um, I'm hyped that I got to drive the car around and do burnouts and burnout and try doing burnouts and then again and again and donuts and then finally doing a fat burnout. So the car donut thing, I don't know why it does that. I'm not even worried. It's cool though. I thought it was gonna be like really, really bad. Only thing is it needs a lot more power. That thing dead hook second gear. I don't know about you, but I want light tires all day, every day. So it needs something about the power, noise is just not there. But I mean, as in terms of car, I didn't really waste time playing with the features. I just wanted to just drive it. It felt really nice. I didn't think it turns crazy, but I'm pretty hyped. I'm excited to see what we can do with it. 
guys want to see more G80 content, be sure to follow me and hit the bell. We're going to be posting more and more about this car. I don't know if you guys are as excited as I am. I originally was not that hyped about it. Came out, I got super pumped up, and I mean, now we have one. It's my car. So, I'm obviously driving this back right now. In a few days, I'll be able to go pick up the car and try out some more things in it. See what else we can do. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I enjoyed doing burnouts in a brand new G80. Before probably anyone else other than BMW was allowed to do burnouts in a brand new G80.